Sometimes to see the whole thing, you can't just stand on the shores and expect to have a complete vision and alertness of what's around you. Sometimes you have to go in the middle of the ocean in order to become aware and have a complete view of what is surrounding you. And perhaps that's what we have to do in order to understand about ourselves, how we feel about things, how we act and react to our things in this journey of life. Maybe it's about the relationship between our thoughts and the consciousness. How is our consciousness put together? Which is the center of us? We should focus on the whole entirety of us, which is to understand how our consciousness is put together. And to understand the relationship between our thoughts and consciousness. To know why we behave the way we do, act and react, emotionally feel this way or that way. It's all about the interaction between our thoughts, consciousness, our fears, desires, and ego, then we have a total and entirety of understanding of what and how we are put together, which would be understanding our center, just like, again, we are in the middle of the ocean and we have a full view of what's surrounding us and the entirety of how we are put together and what we are all about. That is how we can deal with life, to first know how it is that we feel, act, and react to things, and what are the ingredients and components, fragments, involved in how we take this journey of life, in the ocean of life. And perhaps that would be something that you can find out. You can go to my YouTube channel, and the link would be there, or you can go to my site, mindthatseekstruth.com, and look at the table of the contents of the books, and feel and see which one of these books actually could address or help you with what issues you may be facing with, including your relationships, your breakups, and whatever it is that we deal with, it all has to do with how our consciousness, thoughts, egos, desires, and fears interacting and acting and are interrelated. Hope it will be something for you to think about and use to help you out in this journey, and I'll talk to you soon.